Hi friends, welcome back to the channel, SciTechGuru. In this video, I'm going to compare the Anipeshmak test comparison scores between the Damage D8100 processor versus Damage D7050 processor. Right now, I do have the Realme GT Neo 3 device versus Realme 11 Pro Plus device. And we'll try to compare overall Anipeshmak scores, how much difference it will be there regarding the performance wise and the processor between these both devices. So that's what this video is about, where I'll try to show you the benchmark test results. And this overall difference, guys, you can actually expect uh, between these both uh, devices. Like the Damage T7050 versus Damage T8100 processor, you can see the overall scores 8 lakhs versus 5 lakhs 50,000. So there's a difference of 2 lakhs 50,000 difference is there between these both devices. And try to look at the CPU and the GPU scores. So here uh, you may be able to find the difference regarding the CPU and the GPU, how much difference it's there. You can see the GPU segment, it's uh, slightly more difference is there than the CPU, as you can see here, guys. So this is a quick uh, benchmark scores comparison and let it to show you the couple of other benchmark test results what i got uh, between these both the phones so that you can get a clear idea and understanding how much difference the performance can be there regarding this both damage to process so overall as an average 8 lakhs 50 000 i'm getting in this device as an 8 lakhs i'm getting average in the realme gt neo 3 device so this is it, guys thank you for watching this is a quick uh mark test comparison between these both devices and instead of more updates, thank you for watching and bye.